What's up guys and gals, Walter D. Brown over here. Today I'm going to be reacting to some weird ass tape that Charles Barkley had. You can read the title of the video, you can read the title of this video. Uh, Charles, I think you are a little cuckoo if you think. <laughs> I'm just, I, I know what he said, cause I mean it's been running out on Twitter. And uh, I mean Bleacher Report already put it in the headline, but I just want to see his reasons to why he thinks this BS. Let's see. So here's a chance for some of you guys to give me a bold prediction. When you look at the Western Conference standings and the teams that are here. If you hear some background and, noises, uh, there obviously an AC Portland, from the neighbor that's always turned on. They're three and a half behind Memphis as they try to get into that top eight or at least get into that play in if they're within four games of the Grizzlies. And then there were others who were to, like, in that mix out, as well. Uh, when you get down to uh, uh, New Orleans and Sacramento and San Antonio. You know, San Antonio's I don't, I don't, been in the playoffs 22 years in a row. Them. So like, that if you're is in jeopardy. Within Phoenix more than four hasn't been, games, you shouldn't uh, be playing. Since 2010, and they're six games out. So uh, tell me if... 9, 10, 11, 12, or 13 I want to listen to I want is going to, to make to the playoffs. Speak. Who's going? Can I go? What do you got, Shaq? Hey. So I can Whoever go wants a shot at Portland will get in the playoffs. Portland will get in the playoffs. Oh. Portland will get in the playoffs. Okay. I don't agree with that. Right. But. Maybe New Orleans. Maybe nah. Sacramento. Hold it. See, now you have to go. You it's one of those three. You, you realize how many teams. Uh, you realize how uh, many teams that. ahead of them are not going to fall into that. Exactly. I, I know that, but I just gave you three answers. So you just pick one of the three. <laughs> Paul in New Orleans or Sacramento is going to get in. Look at all those trophies. <laughs> hey, Ernie. I'm, Smart guy. I'm looking so for humble. a little bit of a bolder <laughs> prediction than one of these three teams is going to okay, get in there. Ernie. Here comes um, Chuck. Get the okay. post. Yeah. Portland, Portland, get the Portland will ready. make the playoffs. Here comes Chuck. I, 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 okay, I'm take Jackie, you step you've got Parker. Portland. Oh, my God. All right, Charles. Oh, my God. Ew. All right, you got your post Ew. ready for me, Ernie? No. It, no, no, you can't start. Don't interrupt him, Kenny. With an if. You got two reads. Well, he on. doesn't. Let me tell you Let something. Talk. They got to get in first. I'm going to tell you this. Sure. If the Portland Trail Blazers get in the playoffs, they will beat the Los Angeles Lakers in the first round. Ooh. Oh, that is bold. That is pretty Ooh. bold. That is bold. Wow. That is I'm stupid. Give you another one, Ernie. That's not bold. That's stupid. The teams Wait. from five to nine. It doesn't give one of reason. them will be in the NBA championship Western Conference final five through nine. Oh, hold it. What in the Western Conference like or the NBA championship in the Western Conference finals will be five through well, nine. One of those teams. Because so Oklahoma, you know, Houston, said, Dallas, the Rockets are going to win the Memphis. Look. Portland? Six you already nine. said the Rockets are going to win the whole six. thing. Not even nah. five. Yeah, you did that. There's going to be a team. Nah. Without home court advantage, nah. get in because there is no home court advantage. That's nah. my point. Uh, there I agree, is no Kenny. home court advantage. I agree, Kenny. Nah. And Thank teams you, Kenny, like Dallas, I've been the only one saying that. Look I, out I, I for Memphis. Look out for and in this way, this is why I think about it, Ernie. Nah, it's gonna be the Lakers and the Clippers. Everyone knows that. It's gonna be the Lakers and the Clippers. Stop mixing people's head around. The reason that separates championship is inexperience playing on the road. That separates you. There is no inexperience of playing on the road. You don't have to go in Staples Center in game six and worry about a closeout game traveling to there with the hostile environment. Dallas, Memphis, uh, everyone below Portland. that, they don't have that Five same two anxiety nine. Five two that nine they is have going in as the to Los Staples Angeles Center teams. and all those other places. Nah. They have a – now, the, the Lakers are still going to play the way they're playing, play, and, and so are the Clippers. But the gap closes because of the now the experience is not needed. And, uh, well, and, and, and can you add on to that? With, 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 guys, with Portland healthy now, with Nurkic in there, hasn't played all year, with Zach Collins, who hasn't oh played God. since October. I mean, this is Please. a totally this is a totally Stop revamped it. team going into the restart. Stop it. Stop yeah, it. To add on that's to that's what is saying, team. but, if, but if yeah, they, I, I agree with what you're saying. 
inside ahead, the NBA. Chuck, you speak. Go Zoom ahead, Chuck. edition. No, no, go ahead, Chuck. Four, three, two, one, then back well, to one. Go ahead. See, it's not like Shaq and Chuck <laughs> ever let each other talk. So, so Ernie, this I, is a I, go what, ahead, Shaq, what, what Shaq just what Shaq just said, I think is really important. If if Nurchik and Zach Collins are healthy, Nurchik, you know, if if Nurchik and Zach Nurchik. Collins are healthy, Nurchik, you know, D- Dame and CJ are gonna do their thing. Um, they Lamian Dillard, Steph and Clay as the best backcourt. Remember Lamian Dillard, the NBA. Nurchik is terrific. Create that guy in my league. Zach Collins is terrific. Lamian Dillard. White side Dillard. got some to prove. He's gonna be a free agent. The Lakers, to me. They got a couple injuries, but the Trailblazers got to get in first. But I tell you what I'm really hoping for in the Western Conference. And that house is going to be enough I to tire them. The They're Houston not going to be the Lakers. Rockets against the Oklahoma and Sa- City Thunder in Saudi. the playoffs. That Oklahoma is Saudi. my dream come true, Ernie. Chris Paul, the best leader we got, going, going to Houston and kicking their butt. Or LeBron. That would be one of the greatest things I've seen in the NBA in a long time. Sure. Kenny, and right you know, you now, that would, have, that. that would have to I'd happen to a little bit later series, in the playoffs because right How now, Oklahoma happen? City 6, uh, they would play Denver number 3, uh, exactly. Utah and Houston four and, are, are numbers 4 and 5 exactly. uh, right now. But I know exactly what you're, I know exactly what you're talking about. Yeah, they about can't there, meet Chuck. up. Go ahead, they Chuck. Can't meet up. It would be the West Conference Finals. But and Kenny, no, to add on what happen. you're saying about having experience, when you have like home court advantage, your confidence level is different, especially playing at home. So you know the higher <laughs> seeds you must, know with all those trophies must, must change their respect for the lower seeds. Because like that. you said, look at that. There's no home court advantage. Talk about there is being no crowd, humble. And you cannot <laughs> slip up. You cannot slip up because see these lower teams they have something to prove, and they're gonna be playing much harder than the guys. At Chuck the has seats. like modeling because, trophies again, you know, and stuff. When you finish Shaq has like Shaq these four Larry O'Brien trophies. Yeah, you're right. I mean, but you know, when you yeah, at the and when crib, you finish when you, a you game, know, you, you don't go. You're, you're not your getting food, on the plane. Taking your roots to the game, you're not. You're not. So it shouldn't be no fatigue. You know, you don't have the you know wear and tear in your body. Everybody's at the same place, and they're playing in a ballroom. All that that they're saying. Now put it on the good teams. Imagine LeBron at 35. We already saw what happened when he got rest from not being in the playoffs last year. Imagine three months of rest and playing every single game as if it were like a home game in the same city. He's not traveling. He's not like, you know, he's not wasting energy in that. How about Kawhi, PG? Those two guys are always like suffering injuries and like getting rest. They don't have to now because they're not like, oh my God, game, shower, plane, food, sleep, uh, whatever we can sleep. You see? So imagine what they're saying about, yes, of course, the bad teams, now they don't have to travel. Now there's no home game. Now there's no away game. But the same goes to the good teams. Like, I know they're doing this to make people talk. And that's what we're doing. But be logical. <laughs> they're playing in the ballroom. So, you know, I don't think I could do it, Chuck. I don't know. And Kenny, I don't know how you feel. But I need the crowd. I need people pointing, talking noise. Oh, hell yeah. I need to see kids. I need to see... You know, I need to look up and see, you know, Ernie and you guys covering it. So, it, it, so you know, it's definitely going to be a, a different mentality. So, I, I, Kenny, I agree with you that five through nine, any any of those teams can, you know, advance. Can, but so, won't. Kenny, let me get yours straight. So, it's, you say six to nine or five to nine. Kenny, let me Why get yours straight. Why is Barkley saying so no? He said he wanted to see the Rockets. Or five to nine will and win the, the West and get to the NBA Finals. Or get to the or get to no, the Western Conference Finals. They will be in the finals, Western is... Conference Finals. The t- okay. There will not be two teams with home court advantage in the in the Western Conference Finals. Because when you finish right. your game, think about this, Jack and Chuck. They mean top four. Don't say home court. That's the reason. That's the reason you're saying five two nine can make it to the Western Conference Finals because there's no home court advantage. So don't stay home court. You finish your game. You're confusing people. You all walk back in your uniforms back to your hotel together. This is an AAU setting. This is a, a travel ball setting. This is not <laughs> a setting 
that you're going on a plane, you got to think about it, you got to read your papers, you got to hear about it from your local yeah. media. <laughs> Ernie's got a lot of posts. <laughs> you're just coming and playing. So you're not as nervous Both that predictions. anxiety is gone. Both predictions those mania, baby. Teams, those young, inexperienced like five teams. five or six posts and for me, in five minutes. <laughs> John Moran is not in his first year anymore. He's in his second year now. This is his, like John Moran. What Luka Doncic is in his third year. This is, this is a tournament now. This is his, like John Moran. Luka Doncic is in his third year. This is, this is a tournament. Is this is not a continuation of 2020. Don't make mistakes and believe chick. that. Donis These is. guys are different. Well Luka said. Luka Doncic an MVP uh, candidate in his third well year. Said. He's an NBA, he's an Jack, MVP what, candidate what, right now, Luka Doncic. What, what do you mean, what do you mean Donis. well said when he gave himself five chances to get something right? <laughs> He took five teams. <laughs> That's not no average. No, I know you ain't talking. That typically know, would lose. I know you teams. ain't talking. I know you ain't talking. Those are the teams. Hey, 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 one hey. answer. Okay, so that was fun. Um, so that prediction, like you know, about like four to f like from five to nine making the conference finals. Like if it's Houston, I could see it. If it's Oklahoma making a wild push, but I don't see like Dallas. They're not deep enough. Memphis, they're too young to make to like even beat the Lakers, in my opinion. Uh, Portland will make it to eight. They would lose to the Lakers. Um, I'm sorry, Chuck. <laughs> Portland ain't beating LA. Portland ain't beating LA. I'm sorry. Do they have a chance? Yes, because the Lakers are weak. They don't have Bradley. They don't have uh, this guy, Rondo. But they still got waiters. Did I just say they still got waiters? Oh, my God. If, these guys got me crazy. Whatever. Uh, guys, if you enjoyed this, uh, drop a like. Subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be making a lot of reaction videos. I'm going to be making 2K videos. I'm going to be making a lot of videos in a couple of weeks. So stay classy, folks.